Hi, this is Tim Yoder with Fit Small Business. I've been a CPA for 25 years and I've spent the last two and a half years here at Fit Small Business almost exclusively reviewing accounting software, comparing them to one another, and evaluating the best software for companies. So today I'm going to use that experience to help you choose the best QuickBooks Online version for your company. So we'll start with the lowest version, the less expensive version of QuickBooks Online, and work our way up through the upgrades. So I'm not going to tell you every little difference with the different versions. I'm going to focus on the big game changers, the things that help companies decide which software is going to be best for them. So let's start with QuickBooks Self-Employed. This starts at $15 a month, and for that you get just one user. However, you can invite an outside accountant user to access your books as well. They'll use a special accountant version of QuickBooks Self-Employed. QuickBooks Self-Employed is good for freelancers, especially if they like to combine their business activity and their personal activity in one checking account. You can set that checking account to connect to self, QuickBooks Self-Employed, and from there you can separate your personal and business expenses. Um, another thing you can do is you can track your mileage driven in the QuickBooks Self-Employed mobile app. You can do that with all of these versions of QuickBooks Online. And so that's really what QuickBooks Self-Employed is good for. It's just tracking income and expenses in a checking account and perhaps a credit card account after the fact. It's not really useful for managing your business, but part-time self-employed freelancers, this is a very affordable way to track your income and expenses. A couple of very important things that QuickBooks and self-employed is missing that you can solve by upgrading to the next edition is self-employed does not really have a strong invoicing function. So it does have invoicing, but it's really just more of a word processor for invoices almost. You have to type in a complete description of the product and services for each invoice. And finally, payroll. QuickBooks Self-Employed has no way of integrating any sort of payroll system. Um, so if you have employees, then you're going to want to upgrade to the next version of QuickBooks Online. So what is that next version? So the next version is QuickBooks Online Simple Start. Uh, now this is a full double entry bookkeeping system. Self-employed is not. Self-employed is a little different. All it does is track income and expenses. QuickBooks Online Simple Start is a full double entry bookkeeping system, meaning that it will print financial statements. It'll print balance sheets in addition to just the income and expenses. Now QuickBooks Online Simple Start Essentials Plus and advanced. These are all part of the same platform. Um, as you progress up through the versions, they simply turn on more and more features. QuickBooks Self-Employed is a little different. It's on a little bit different platform. So QuickBooks Online Simple Start. This to me is what I kind of consider the first true QuickBooks Online program because it does easily upgrade to the others. Now QuickBooks Online Simple Start will cost $25. You still only get one user. However, you can invite two outside accountants to access your books. Um, and so that could perhaps be a bookkeeper that you're using um, perhaps to help you along learning QuickBooks as well as maybe a tax accountant. Um, the main reasons you're going to upgrade from self-employed to Simple Start is that you can quickly issue invoices and track them until they're paid. So they have a very good invoicing function in Simple Start. It's the same invoicing function as all of your higher levels of QuickBooks Online. So it's very, very good for issuing invoices. Um, Self-employed, if you issue just a couple invoices a month, perhaps the same company that you do all your work for, you probably don't need a great invoicing function. But if you're doing invoicing to multiple customers every week, absolutely spend the extra money to upgrade to Simple Start from Self-employed. Now the other big upgrade is that you can have integrated payroll, so QuickBooks Payroll will integrate with Simple Start. Um, there's an extra fee to it, but the integration is very seamless, very easy to use, and well worth it. Um, there are a few other perks to self-employed that I don't necessarily consider a game changer, but you can print checks directly from the software. You can subscribe to QuickBooks Live, which is a service offered by QuickBooks that pairs you with a QuickBooks Pro Advisor that you can meet with as often as necessary to help you along with your QuickBooks accounting. Um, and as we said, it's a double entry bookkeeping system, so it does print a balance sheet. Now there's a couple of important things Simple Start is missing um, that if you need, you're gonna wanna upgrade to the next version. So bill tracking, so this means bills coming in from your vendor. You cannot enter those until you actually pay them in Simple Start. And the next is time tracking. So let's look at the next version of QuickBooks Online and how it can handle those functions.
So our next version is QuickBooks Online Essentials. This is a fairly substantial upgrade and you go from $25 a month to $50 a month, but you do have three users. So this might be nice in a little bit larger company. So you may perhaps you have the owner um, plus a controller and then maybe an accounts payable clerk. So those could be your three users. Um, in, in Essentials, you can track your unpaid bills, as we said, so as vendor, bills come in you can enter them before you pay them QuickBooks will organize them tell you when they're due show you if they're overdue um, you can pay multiple vendor bills all at one time so pull up all the bills for a particular vendor place a check mark next to the ones you want to pay hit a button and it'll print a check paying all of those bills so very handy and the second thing and this is probably the biggest reason to upgrade from simple start to essentials is that you can track time and expenses and bill those to clients so if you're a consulting firm really any firm that charges clients by the hour you really need essentials you can track your time in there give a billable rate to each user when you create an invoice for that customer it's going to pull up all the time you've charged to that customer and give you the option of adding that time and any billable expenses to that invoice so if you bill clients for expenses and time you absolutely need to upgrade from simple start to essentials well worth the money now what is essentials missing the biggest thing it's missing is inventory accounting if you have inventory you can't use online essentials you're going to need to upgrade to our next version, which is QuickBooks Online Plus. So QuickBooks Online Plus, substantial upgrade, goes from $50 to $80, but for that $80, you get five users. Now, that's enough for most small businesses, five users. Again, this isn't five employees. This is five people that need access to your QuickBooks accounting. So that's a pretty good size small business. Um, the main reason to upgrade from Essentials to Plus again is inventory accounting. Now the trick with inventory accounting is you need to be able to allocate the cost of your purchases during the year, right? You're purchasing inventory all year long and then at the end of the year you're going to have some inventory on hand. You need to be able to separate the cost of all of those purchases into what was the cost of my goods that I sold and what is the cost of my remaining inventory on hand and that's what QuickBooks Online Plus can do for you and it does this using what we call the last in first out accounting method and that is the only accounting method offered um, for QuickBooks Online Plus but that is essential if you have inventory you do not want to try to do that by hand it is not worth it don't use spreadsheets very much it's very worth it to upgrade to QuickBooks Online Plus Okay, a couple other things Plus does. Uh, you can track income and expenses by location and class. So if you have different classes of products, different classes of service, or different locations, um, or both, you can track by class, by location. Uh, very handy for reporting purposes. And then the last thing is it can track profit and loss by project. So if you are a construction company, perhaps you work on multiple projects, you want to determine is the project itself profitable, you're going to need to track profit and loss by project. QuickBooks Online Plus does that. You can't do that with any of the lower versions. Now, our last and most advanced version of QuickBooks Online is QuickBooks Online Advanced. This is a big upgrade price-wise. We go from $80 a month to $180 per month, but that includes 25 users, which is a very large amount of users. That's, that's almost a mid-sized company. That's a lot of accounting users in your department there. Um, now, with those 25 users comes customized user rights. So that means you can specify exactly which what each user can see within QuickBooks, which of course is absolutely necessary when you have 25 users, right? You can't let everybody have access to everything in your QuickBooks, right? You obviously can't have more than just a couple of people having access to the payroll within QuickBooks Online. So you can give them very customized user rights. Now, there is some user differentiation in the lower levels but not like this in this QuickBooks Online Advanced you can go line by line and you can really assign in, in very minute detail what each user can and cannot do and so for bigger organizations absolutely crucial some other upgrades for QuickBooks um, Advanced you have the option to track your inventory costs by either the LIFO method, which is what we discussed before for PLUS, but you could also choose to use the average cost method, which is probably the more popular 
method. Um, and another huge perk of having advanced is a dedicated contact person for customer support. You have an account manager that when you have a question, you call that person. That is a huge perk of having QuickBooks Online Advanced, right? You don't have to call the general customer support line. You call your person. They know your company. They know the problems you've had in the past. It's so much easier to solve your problems when you have a uh, one particular contact person. So QuickBooks Online is advanced, is expensive, but you get 25 users. And that's probably the most common reason people would upgrade. With simply, you need more than five users, so you jump up to QuickBooks Online Advanced. But there are some very good uh, benefits that come with that as well. Okay, so what is next in your QuickBooks journey? Well, if you've decided which QuickBooks Online is going to be best for you, you can actually sign up now. There's a link if you found this video on YouTube. There is a link in the description to QuickBooks Online and you can sign up for your choice of either a 30-day free trial or 50% off for three months. If you're not quite sure yet, which QuickBooks Online is right for you, we have an entire article dedicated to this subject that will go into a lot more detail about the different plans. And I've included a link for your reference in the description to this video to our QuickBooks Online comparison. So I hope this video was useful and you've been able to determine exactly which QuickBooks Online plan is right for you. Again, my name was Tim Yoder with Fit Small Business and you have a great day.